Okay, Dash Shell Rose here back again. Yeah, my, my video thing keeps stopping on its own. It's honestly getting on my nerves. As I was trying to say, I was trying to, to, to make a video about some news. Um, um, I'll talk about that in a second. I forgot to bring this up. That, um, I'm, I'm, uh, I've talked to the Elgato people and they're gonna take a look at my Elgato capture card. So hopefully I don't have to use this godforsaken phone anymore because I am so sick of this thing. Stopping my videos in the middle of them. It's so annoying. I'm so tired of it Anywho enough about that enough about that short rant. Um, yes I am you know working on the Elgato thing. I've been working on it for several months now Hopefully maybe I can get it fixed now Anywho, I'm gonna talk about Marvel now, as I'm, a, a lot of people are a fan of Marvel, I'm not really a fan of Marvel. I don't really care for Marvel or Star Wars. That, and, and not Star Wars, I mean DC Comics that much. I'm not really a fan of either one of them. I was never really a fan of Marvel and all that. However, how come, how come, you're probably asking yourself, how come I'm talking about Marvel then? Well, apparently there's a lawsuit going against Marvel. There's a lawsuit going against Marvel, though. I chose this cartoon image of 2D animated Spider-Man and all that because I like 2D animated movies over CGI. This is, like, I guess, a TV show. But, yeah, um... But, yeah, apparently the comic book people that were originally behind... The Marvel comic books before they became movies are responsible for making, well, for creating these characters. And they want the rights back to it. Um, but I gotta say, I, I think this is going to fail. This is gonna fail, um, because look at Disney's history. I mean, people have tried to sue Disney over the years. They tried to sue Disney. But yeah, Disney though, I don't think I don't think they're going they're going to lose their rights to Marvel. If they lost the rights to Marvel, they would have less control of the movie market. But um But yeah, they um but they but they they are they're not going to lose the rights to Marvel. This is the same situation that happened with DC Comics and DC well, DC, um, with AK Warner Brothers completely screwed them over and got the, the rights to it. That's what's gonna happen with, with Marvel and Disney. And Sony owns the Spider-Man movies, so if Sony, um, if Sony, um, lost Marvel, they would lose Spider-Man. So I, I, I doubt this is gonna happen, because Disney has the best in lawyers on the planet. They have no problem screwing their employees over. I'd be, I'd be funny just if I saw Scarlett Johansson, part of the lawsuit, consider she was Black Widow, and this is a Marvel Sue thing, and they completely screwed her over. I'd be surprised if she was part of it, ended up being a part of it too. But yeah, um, but yeah, Disney has no problem paying their employees. Using COVID-19 for an excuse to not pay their employees like Scarlett Johansson, Bill Nye the Science Guy, and all of that. But they can't, they had no problem paying for these lawyers to go to court and all that. And I, I, I hate Disney. Now, Disney's not a magical company they once were. They, they, they're just, they just use excuses and all of that, but... Yeah, there's a lawsuit going against them, um, Disney and all that, and I'm, um, and I guess I also heard in the news that the Guardian and the Galaxy movies, apparently they're can they canceled, um, the third one in development, I guess, according to an article I read. I mean, Guardians and the Galaxy was one of the few Marvel movies I actually liked. But I guess the third one's getting cancelled. But yeah, I, I doubt Disney's going to lose the rights to 
Marvel. I wish they would, because right now they own they own like a good portion of the Marvel universe. And wait, well, let's be fair though. Mar Marvel is failing anyway. It's failing. I I, I don't know why the, the people behind the comics want Marvel back so bad. It's failing. It's not doing very good. There's been a lot of bombs in the box office and all that for Marvel movies. Who knows, Marvel could be shut down next. I mean, Disney already shut down Blue Sky Studios. If Marvel fails, they could shut down Marvel too. Now, some people in the comments might be, disagree with me, and that's fine, but... But if it's not doing very good and they're getting... They're, they're having a lot of bombs in the box office. It, they could shut down Marvel, period. And, um, yeah. Marvel was already failing before Disney bought it. And when Disney bought Marvel, they saved it for a while. But Marvel is now going back down under again. Who knows? It could be sold off in the future. I mean, Bob Iger is leaving Disney. And, uh, I guess apparently he wants to be part of the President of the United States or whatever. I don't know. I... I thought that was a room, just a joke, but no, I guess it's serious. I read about that. So I guess Bob Iger thinks having enough power, this much power isn't enough. He wants to be president too, but whatever. I'm not talking about that though. I'm talking about Marvel. But yes, Marvel is, um, you know, a, a massive corporation. It uh, has a bunch of superheroes in it, like Spider-Man, the Hulk, Deadpool, and all of that. However, um, however, the people behind the comics want it back, and I'm afraid they may not get it back. I mean, look what happened to uh, the Predator movies. A lot of people don't talk about this, but there was a, a ru rumor a, for a long time. Well, it wasn't a rumor, it was actually the truth. The, the people behind the Predator movies were trying to sue Disney for the rights back to it because Disney wouldn't let them get it back. And they ended up winning the lawsuit. Now, I think it's still f going on because they ended up dumping the Predator, five, I think it was five movie on Hulu and said Disney Plus. So there must be some problems going on behind the scenes there. But th this is kind of a similar situation where... Where the people behind the comic com, comic book in, industry of Marvel want the rights back, but I doubt they're gonna get it back. I I I I feel bad. I mean, Disney owns like thirty eight percent of the movie market, is what I found out. That's actually not really that much, and yet they they're screwing a lot of crap up. If just imagine how much power Disney could have if they owned fifty percent of the movie market. I didn't even know they owned only thirty eight percent. Yeah, they totally overspent on Fox. Yeah, they did get part of Marvel and like Deadpool and the X Men franchise, but they really overspent on Fox. If they only got up to thirty eight percent of it, I thought it was forty like five or something, but I was wrong. So yeah, Disney really didn't get a lot of money out of Fox either and all that. And now you got people trying to um, trying to sue them for Predator and Marvel and all that. And yeah, just um. But yeah, I just um, like I said, I'm not really a huge fan of Marvel. I just don't really care too much about it. But I have heard it's been failing. It's been failing in the box office. Captain Marvel did bad. Black Widow did bad. The only thing that's making Disney money is Sony. I mean, not Sony. I mean, um, Spider-Man. Because Spider-Man, the movies are owned by Sony. If they own Spider-Man, Spider-Man probably be doomed too. Because Disney has no idea what they're what they're doing. They buy all this stuff up and they deal with lawsuits like this without even thinking. Because they they own they own Marvel now, so they technically own. They have to deal with the lawsuits and stuff. Now, Disney could just, I don't know, just give them, make a deal with them or something. But, I don't know, they may just, I don't know, they, I, I doubt they're going to do anything. That They're just going to pay for these lawyers to, 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 um, they're going to pay for these lawyers to, 
to um, help them win the lawsuit because they, they say they don't have this money to pay for it, but they paid for 20th Century Fox by spending 20, I mean, $71 billion for it. And they, they have all this money to build these hotels and stuff, but yet they can't pay their employees. So, yeah, I wouldn't work for Disney anymore. I really wouldn't. Um, but yeah, um, but that's the thing. That's that's what what's happening. And um, yeah, I don't I don't think Disney's gonna lose the rights to Marvel. I think they're gonna end up keeping it. And the, just like the Predator movies, they're gonna win the, the lawsuit because, like I said, they they're gonna pay, pay all this money for these good lawyers that they could be using to pay for pay for their employees. Because I've been hear hearing a lot of a lot of drama going on behind the scenes that Disney isn't paying all their employees. Uh, but yeah, um, anywho, I'm gonna let this go, and I will see you guys later. Um, I know this video came out kind of late. It was put, like this lawsuit thing popped up in, on Friday, but I already made a news video at that time. And I didn't want to have a Disney video that week. I'm trying not to talk about Disney as much anymore. I just felt like this was interesting to talk about. Anywho, please like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And please, please down below, tell me, tell me what you guys, um, tell me, tell me, are you guys a fan of Marvel or, or do you guys not care about Marvel like me? It's okay if you guys like it. It's your opinion. I'm just curious. Anywho, bye.